Hi, this is Helmut Flash. Let's talk about how can you guarantee that your marketing will work because after all, you don't have money to burn. Well, anyway, that's the question I get quite often from um, prospects and clients uh, who want to do everything they do to make sure it works. There's nothing wrong with wanting to make sure it works except that it is pretty wrong um, because it will put you in a defensive state, it will put you in a state of inaction, and most of the time you will do nothing. Anything you do is better than nothing, even though at the short term it doesn't look like that. As Mr. Bill Gates very, very clearly says um, in his book, Business at the Speed of Thought, uh, somewhere in 1995, whenever he wrote it, um, he says, people always hugely overestimate the short term result of anything they do and underestimate the long-term result. So most people, you know, oh, I just spent 2,000 here, 3,000 there, 4,000 here, and it didn't work. Most of the time it didn't work because you didn't keep it going. And most of the time it didn't work because you did a, um, a kind of like a, a, a shooting duck kind of like a, uh, a, a, a approach. You, you, you didn't, uh, you are bee hoping approach. You did this one, see where it works, how oh, it didn't work. Do this one, see where it works, oh, it didn't work. Did this one, see it works, oh, it didn't work. Now you did three of them which didn't work. You just spent 10 grand on marketing over a half a year or a year or whatever, uh, maybe over five months. And now you become gun shy and you do nothing. Okay, well, chances are you were doomed from the beginning because you didn't do all three at the same time. Okay, um, no war general will go and say, let's send in 50,000 troops or 50 million troops. And when they're all dead, then we send in the dunks. And when they're all shut down, then we send in the airplanes. And when they are all shut down, then we send in the ships. And when they're all sunk, then we go and go for the sharpshooters. And when they're all sunk, then we go and uh, uh, whatever. Then we go and try intelligence. Well, maybe you should have tried some intelligence before. Nobody will do what I just said. But with marketing, most small businesses, that's exactly what they do. No synergy, no systematic approach, dead. No strategy. So, what are some of the strategies that you will probably lose little money so that you can survive the losses? I, I understand all about cannot lose too much. I, I got it, I got it. But perhaps you'll lose something if the biggest marketing minds on this planet said that half, half of what they do doesn't work. What do you think you and me? I know people like me use this datum to, to, to tell other people that this is how it is so we can tell you to do more. I, I got that too. But you know what it is is what it is. You know what it is is what it is. It's a little bit like kind of like saying you know, uh, a 16 year old kid falling in love and saying, you know, I, 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 the first girl I ever meet and kiss uh, gotta be my wife. I mean, if it is, wonderful. But rather than that, I mean, falling in love, falling out love is, is part of growing up, isn't it? Good. However, you should be approaching. The new thing, the new kit on the block called social media, very inexpensive and I have videos on how to do that. Public relation in itself with social media is and getting the community leaders involved and most importantly um, getting them to market for you. Um, basically approach a few people who then approach many other people who then even approach other people in that can be done and that can be done with the amount of money where you never spend thousands and thousands and thousands in one shot and hope for it to work where you just can plug away as a machine and wait till it comes and where it isn't all that devastating if it takes two months or five months or six months or for that much even a year where you can make it through because the amounts are not so huge and they're not based on one thing. That's my God. I mean, who wants to base his life on one thing? It's not possible. If I would be you being a doctor, I would not even possibly base my income on just one income, such as being a doctor. Personally, I think that's insane, you know, because insurances, governments and etc. and regulations and, and, and not knowing when you lose your license because of like some, you know, I would never do that. I would always have even other business sources, never mind in marketing, you've got to have many marketing sources and, um, and you know, you, you, you got the basic data and the other stuff is on my other videos, go and watch them for free, of course.